what's going on everyone hope you could hear me and everyone's having a good time i have changed the layout uh significantly wanted to make it a little bit more professional hope y'all like it um but yeah so we've got a new layout we're gonna continue pokemon blue the adventure continues um down below you could see our party right now as we're going through it so we've got charm at charmeleon clefairy um bellsprout <laughs> uh doug trio mr mime which is named marcel we got through a trade and pidgeotto so uh thank you for showing for being here drop a chat say hi let's hang out and have some fun um the whole point of this is really just to reminisce with some pokemon games and just have a good time so without further ado uh we'll hop back into pokemon blue we'll load up and uh, we'll start from there so drop a chat if you're on and uh if you're not following me please follow so we'll continue our adventure and we'll take from there so we are right now we are outside of the rock tunnel um one thing we haven't done is assign flash to one of the pokemon now there's a lot in a lot of games you have the best pokemon to turn into what's called an hm slave or an hm user the best for Pokemon Blue, from a lot of the research I've seen, is actually a combo between Char uh, Charmeleon or Charizard and Slowpoke or Slowbro. You give Charmeleon um, or Charizard a learn cut, and what's the second one? Drawing a blank on the second one. But uh, Slowbro will get Surf will learn flash i think and strength so co making a combination between those two really helps out so we have to teach flash right now so we get through the rock tunnel right now we've got between clefairy and marcel i think we're going to teach it to marcel because he has an open move there we go and now we can move um move forward from there so we'll try we'll go ahead i keep forgetting that in this game you have to select the pokemon to cut and we've got Shaky to cut. And we'll go through the rock tunnel. Pitch black. So we'll use Marcel to flash and right up the area. As soon as we walk in, we've got we've got an encounter with Zubat. These the bats are all over the place. It's ridiculous. In Pokemon Ar Legends Arceus, they are terrible absolutely horrendous chasing you and just trying to suck the life out of you um but it's burnt which is great it means it's gonna die next round if this doesn't hit we hit we're good so go from there we've got oh yeah this is gonna be a, a lengthy area so just we're gonna scratch uh, like I said, if we want um, Charmeleon to learn Cut, it's basically strong, a little bit stronger than Scratch, so it's easy to have that move. I forgot to start that timer, so we are going to resume our timer here. Uh, ignore the minute I spent talking. I don't think there's anything there, so we're just going to go and have our first battle. Now, the advantage of selecting Bulbasaur or Squirtle in the beginning of the game is that you have a good, solid uh, type advantage in the Rock Tunnel. We do not. And if you remember from last time, I made a huge mistake by getting rid of Vine Whip on uh, Bellsprout. Yeah, I was tired and I made a huge mistake and I, re I, I regret it to this day. Um, but... We do, we do have our visitor, Clefable, that knows Bubble Beam. So, we do have a, a, a strong water move, um, but it's still 
it's still frustrating. So, Cubone, I'm going to throw uh, Pidgeot in. Um, just the flying advantage there. So we're going to hit it with a gust attack. And just get let Pidgeotto get, get that experience. Because Bone Club does not affect Pidgeotto flying. Try to hit it with a little bone. Yeah, boom, boom, boom. Versus a flying bird. Yeah, good luck, Cubo. Not going to work. So, crit. And, and we're... We defeat, I think. No, one more. Pokemaniac. And we've got against Slowbro. We do not have an electric type. Um, so we might as well leave Pidgeot in here. Again, hit him with Gust to start off. Uh, he's going to use Confusion. Solid attack. We're going to try and Sand attack him. So he doesn't do that. Here with another Sand attack. He misses. Excellent. Do a third Sand attack. He misses again. This is great. We're going to quick attack. And we're actually going to switch Pokemon out. Uh, I'm trying to think of type advantage here off the top of my head. But we're going to let... We're going to let Visitor take this one. And she's just gonna smack him. And there we go. We've got, we defeated our first trainer in the rock tunnel. Nothing crazy. Again, with type advantages, uh, it, this would be a lot faster and easier, but we do what we can. We've got Geodude and da, 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 da. Sleep powder does not work on rock types. No, oh, it does work. I thought it didn't work on rock types. All right, so we put him to sleep. Let's see if wrap works. Wrap's a normal type, so it's, it's not gonna work well. Um, at this point, we might just level up Marcel. Marcel, Marcel. All you think up there is friends. Um, the monkey, Marcel, and now we have our own Marcel hanging out with us. Second trainer battle. Another slow, slow poke, so uh, obviously we're not going to keep... Um, definitely not going to keep Char Fireboy in there. Oh, I disabled Dig. Oh my god, that's... Hmm. The move I wanted to use. Of course it disabled that. So, we're gonna hit Sand Attack. We're no longer disabled on uh, with Dig, so... We're using Dig. Oh, uh, and I thought that was gonna knock it out, but it did not. So, we are going to... Oh, 1 HP. Scratch with Duck Trio. Somehow they have arms and they can scratch. I would love to know how on earth they're able to scratch. No idea. But Fireboy has grown. And we defeated Pokemania. Second trainer in the rock tunnel. Done. So far, we've seen Geodude and Zubat in here. Uh, I believe there are others. Yeah, there's a chance to encounter Machop and Onyx. Um, if we can, if we do encounter an Onyx, I might go ahead and try and catch him, just so we have a solid rock type. Um, but we shall see. Uh, da, 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 da. We'll use Marcel. 
He'll hit with confusion. And there we go. Easy does it. Uh, just trying to explore here what we've got. If there's anything of value. Excuse me while I have something to eat. Sorry, got a little distracted. Alright, let's continue. Nothing down there. Sweet, we did not get an encounter. Didn't mean to change the layout, but it's fine. Stay hydrated as always. Get, keep your water close. Keep drinking it. Or whatever else you like to drink. Orange juice, coffee, tea. Try and hydrate more than drinking coffee and energy drinks. Oh, sweet, we have a type advantage against an Oddish here. We are going to... Oh. I was just about to say, we're going to destroy Oddish, and then it... We are fully paralyzed. Okay, this is great. And we used Ember. Okay, there we go. What I was trying to do in the very beginning, but of course, our luck. Our first attack missed, and then Oddish had to stun us. Yes, yeah, super effective. It's like I did it on purpose. Got to use Bulbasaur. We are not changing Pokemon. We're gonna let Fireboy take this all the way. Apparently Bulbasaur had a speed advantage here. I don't understand how, but... Two hit, knock it out, we're good. And I'm gonna take a victory bite. Is trainer number three. Another Zubat. Oh, I was trying to escape. We can't escape. That's not fun. Still can't escape. Okay, fine. I don't understand why we don't have a good... Mm, he's fully paralyzed. It just... Oh. Alright, Marcel. Let's see what you got. Hit him with confusion. Oh, super effective, but he's down to one?
down to one HP, and then he was able to absorb life. This does not seem proper. Alright, we are going to make a switch here. We're going to switch, put Marcel in our starting lineup. Uh, he's a little bit weak right now, but he should be able to help us. So we're going to put a barrier up um, just to help the defense side, and then we're going to throw Infusion against Charmander. Critical hit, great. Charmander's using Rage. Thankfully, uh, the barrier helped. Oh, he landed a crit. All right. No, we're going to keep Marcel and... Oh, I thought Confucian would do a little bit strong, more of a... All right. Thankfully, there we go. We got lucky. I'll take that luck. We defeated Pokemaniac, and with that... I'm going to have a bite of another sandwich. They say variety is the spice of life, so have yourself two different types of sandwiches. And don't forget to make a mess. Ooh, that will knock us out. Yep, that knocked us out. Oh, too bad. Too bad, too bad, too bad. Oh, I knew it wasn't effective, but I thought it would knock a level 16 out. We got a Zubat, and we're going to try and get away. We're just going to Mega Punch. You know, it's not very effective. Worse, in, at least in this gen. Oh, come on. He's got like 3 HP. Fine. We'll pound. way do we go? I don't remember which way we go, but... Ooh, we have a wild Machop. Do we want to catch a fighting type? We do not have a fighting type right now. We are not going to be able to get Machamp, the final evolution, so is there really a benefit of having Machop and Machope? We could always go for a different fighting type. See if we catch us a Hitmonchan, Hitmonlee, uh, Mankey um, for Primate, but with this one, yeah, knock him out. And with that, we were in, right into a Pokemon battle. Welcome, thanks for joining, playing some Pokemon Blue. We are in the middle of Rock Tunnel, fighting against a hiker now. So he's sending out a Machop. We've got Clefable. Um, if you were here last week, the layout looks completely different because I spent some time building a new layout and overlay. I uh, kind of like it, but if you have any comments, please feel free. If you don't follow already, please follow uh, as I'm trying to grow and become an affiliate plus more. Uh, so we're just going to keep. He's fighting with Onyx. We're going to hit with Bubble Beam just to one hit knockout. There we go. And move on from that. We defeated Hiker. Awesome. We're going to switch our layout because Visitor is our. Yeah, Visitor is our. 
Big hitter. Don't remember where all the items are in this... in the rock tunnel. I don't know if there are any items in the rock tunnel. Uh, is this another hiker? Yeah, it's a hiker. I think the hiker and the... karate... master or whatever look the exact same. I think they look the exact same. This was an 8 megabit system. Still pretty impressive what they were able to do with it. We're gonna try and put on uh, Onyx to sleep. Awesome. We put him, we were able to put him to sleep. Uh, da, 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 you know, who do we want to let out to play? Shaky doesn't have any strong attacks right now. Um, sure, we'll, look, we'll see if our Charmeleon. Oh, he woke up. He had to wake up. So, with that, we'll switch out. We'll grab Visitor back. Our Clefable is really the one carrying our team right now. Um, been that way for a while. So, we'll let Clefable keep carrying the team. Oh, come on. Alright, we defeated the first Onyx. Shaky grew. About to use another Onyx. Will we change Pokemon? And I think I'm going to say yes because you followed the, chant, the stream from the very beginning. I'm a big fan of Sand Attack in this first gen. I wasn't when I was a kid. Now as an adult, yeah, Sand Attack's definitely the way to go. So, we sand attacked, and then we're gonna switch out, uh, da, 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 da. Look at the team, it's just limited options. I mean, we need some variety. Now we're gonna hit dig. Our Pidgeo, uh, Pidgeotto grow to level 24. Uh, da, 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 da. will we change Pokemon? No. Just so we can finish this battle and knock it out. Hit him with a dig and super effective. Done. Easy. And go from there. If you want to follow any of my social media accounts, watch any of the previous videos, I upload a lot of the previous videos uh, to YouTube. Some of the clips and some of the adventures. Uh, started a Twitter account, going to post my schedule and stuff like that on there as well. Um, so if you want, take a chance, you'll see it scrolling on the bottom. Just notate it, it's either going to be Barbasar Gaming or Barbasar underscore. Alright, so we move on from here. I th think, yep, there's the ladder. We'll go into that ladder. Show some respect to the fat hikers. Alright, we're starting off. We got Shaky. We'll slow, throw some sleep powder. Didn't affect him this time. Ooh. While he's fast asleep, we'll so throw sand in his eyes. Now that he's asleep and blind, we'll burn him. Oh. Oh, wow, his self-destruct missed. Sand attack is the way to go. I have never had a self-destruct miss in any of the games I've ever played in my life with Pokemon. For a self-destruct to miss, like, think about it. A suicide bomber missed, and it's standing right in front of you. Sand attack works. Use sand attack. Probably shouldn't have said suicide bomber, but oh well. Yeah, I lost a fall. I lost a viewer there. 
Eh, oh well. I can say it. Uh, we got Graveler, so we're going to go back to... Da, 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 da. You know what, I'm going to end this, so we're going to go back to Clefable, our visitor from the moon, and hit him with a bump. Double attack. away from Zubat. Da, 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 da. Junior trainer, she's sending out a Jigglypuff. We'll try to put Jigglypuff to sleep. Jigglypuff apparently is going to put us to sleep. So we'll switch it out with Fireboy and hope he he's he's still fully disabled. Okay, there we go. Critical hit. Beautiful. About to use Pidgey. No, we'll keep we'll keep him out here. Pidgey speed wins against Charmeleon, um, especially when using Quick Attack. But paralyzed again. Yeah. So we'll do Pidgeotto against Pidgey, and of course he gets the crit. Thankfully, our Pidgeotto was, about, was able to win out. Yeah, it's a little bit of XP. A little bit of XP is a little is better than no XP. So, we'll, we're just going to keep that. Uh, da, 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 da. Yes, we're going to switch Pokemon because down to one. And we're gonna scratch me out with a worm. A worm is gonna scratch me out. Coins are scattered everywhere. Hopefully that means I get to pick them up when I defeat her. And there we go, we've defeated her. I don't know. Oh yeah, we did pick up a couple extra coins. Wonderful. Jakey's still asleep, so we are just going to... We're just going to blow it out of the water with Clefable and Bubble Beam. Yeah, keep Clefable. Clefable gets all the XP. Trio get used dig. Super effective against rock. Beautiful. We got my chop. And Shaky wake up. Shaky's not gonna wake up, so we're gonna try and run away. Before we get stuck in. funny how we have Shaky's asleep but I'm still able to run away it's don't I'm not a big fan of the effects sometimes yeah oh all right 
thankfully this is not a Nuzlocke game where we don't we would have lost three Pokemon, but even if we did, I wouldn't have been that upset about it. Marcel, I would have been upset about. That was a psychic type that I wanted to keep. Um, we're just gonna dig through with this trainer. Yeah. One hit. No. Apparently, all he did was catch slow pokes. Must have been a very, very fun day of just throwing balls at little slow pokes. And we put the feet of the Pokemaniac. Switch our order here. I think we have three more trainers and we're out. Oh, perfect pairing there. I don't know why it didn't one hit kill Bellsprout. It should have. It really should have. Oh well. Fairy, we're gonna try and use and do the same thing, just burn through the fairy. Ooh. No? Oh. Double slap. Ooh. Okay, okay, we defeated one tra one trainer. I think there's two left. She's complaining that it was too dark. Well, she should have used Flash. Well, yeah, but they could still wiggle themselves out. Slowpoke was ex is not a bad Pokemon. He's going. I'm gonna catch one. I need one for all the HMs. It's just, I think the. The animation... Oh, he's paralyzed again. My God. The animation made Slowpoke seem like it was a useless Pokemon because he was like, Slowpoke. Slowpoke. But in reality, Slowpoke isn't that bad. They're actually pretty powerful. Um, and they know a variety of moves. Like, if we had Slowpoke, <clears throat> if we had Slowpoke in this battle, it would have been easy. We would have crushed them because we have a Water and Psychic type, uh, which is a very strong combo in Pokemon Blue. And for right now, we're just going to keep hitting them with Dig and just knock them out. Don't know what her last Pokemon is. Gonna take a chance since it's a bell sprout and put Fireboy back and oh, why are you so paralyzed? Break out of it. There we go. Break out of it. Do not be paralyzed. Oh keep using growth. Let me burn him. Are you kidding me? Alright, we're gonna switch Pokemon because he's got one HP and I feel like he's gonna actually attack on this one. Yep, he did something. But, either way, bird knocked out. Beautiful. No, they're not running away, but they also... It doesn't mean that they you could catch them easily. I don't know. Alright, I think we're almost out. I don't want, I don't know if it's beneficial to catch him a chop in this game. Uh, I don't think there's anything up there as far as items. We've got one last battle, I believe, against a junior trainer. She starts out with Meowth. Now we'll switch with Buffable.
Even though Clint Abel's asleep, we're gonna try and wake Clint Abel up. Come on, Clint Abel, wake up. Come on. Lazy visitors, wake up. There we go. Finally woke up. Just in time to hit me out with a mega punch, and we get to pick up all that payday loot. I just want to understand. Why does Meowth... How does he make coins? I get it's a move, but where does it come from? I mean, we always heard, growing up we always heard the expression, money doesn't grow on trees, but apparently Meowth just makes money. And then, in with Team Rocket, the Meowths focused all his energy on learning how to talk, that he forgot payday. I'm sorry, how? The one Pokemon in the world that could create money to buy food and he instead chose to learn English to talk, or language to talk, not necessarily English, and yet was poor the entire time. Just saying. I don't know why they let they created the move payday. I I don't think they should have created that. I don't see a benefit to it. But it's funny how Meowth learns payday, but never never knew how to use it in the animation. And we picked up 80 coin. Beautiful. Another Machop. Oh, no, don't you. And we made it through the rock tunnel. Oh. She's feeling faint, but she wants to fight. That's rude. It's rude as hell. So, with that, we're gonna use Doug Trio and just knock the crap out of her. Try to manipulate the sandwich before it spills all over me. Oh, that's right. Dig doesn't affect Pidgey. Even though Pidgey never flies, it just sits on the ground, but. Fine. That was a, oh yeah, mo moment. It's great that it's using Whirlwind. So we'll try and scratch Fidgey. Now I want people to picture how a Doug Trio jumps in the air in order to scratch a Pidgey. Gonna hit an item. I just happened to remember that from 20 years ago, 25 years ago. A little proud of myself that I actually remember that. Did not remember that part. Did not remember that there was someone there. I remembered the rock. No, I don't remember that annoying bastard. So, with a hiker, you know how to deal with him. We'll deal with him. It's more annoying than anything else. Bubble Beam. Again, if you started with um, 
either Bulbasaur or Squirtle, you would have been fine through. You would have been, we would have been much better off through Rock Tunnel. Um, but Charmander is cooler. No. We're gonna stick around. We're gonna wait to keep Fizzer and just destroy Onyx. And we come to the Pokemon Center for some much needed healing. Very much needed healing. And we're going to do a swap here since um, I'm actually going to teach Parmelian Cut so we keep that move. Um, and I'm going to get rid of Shaky. Just because I, without having a, um, without having um, a solid grass move, Shaky is useless right now, and I just don't feel like dealing with him. So we're gonna teach uh, Charmeleon Cut, and I'm going to try not to speed through this. And we're actually going to just replace it with Scratch for the time being. I know we have uh, Growl and Leer, and we'll change those out. But there's no point of having Cut and Scratch um, moving forward. Also going to, while we're here, just deposit some of the items that we have. Uh, so we're just going to deposit... Uh, I'm going to deposit the rare candy for right now. Um, and some of the HP up, we'll deposit that. And let's see. Because we're very limited in this game on item location, I don't want to have the same problem where we try to try and grab something and end up not having enough room for storage. So if we've got a couple of battles uh, here, just to finish out, I think there's two battles here. We'll knock them out and then we'll move on to the other areas. There's a feeling you get from the moment your plane touches down. It's the pure relaxation. Ignore the ad. Apparently, it's a Bregan National Airport ad. No one needs to listen to that. So, Cubone versus Marcel. Start off with confusion, uh, and he has nothing to combat that. I'm back. When we get to the point where we get subscribers, I will happily accept any donations to pay for a good streaming music service. But we have to get to affiliate first, and for that, need to need to get more people watching the stream. And we'll get there. This is just for fun anyway, so... It'll take might take a little bit longer, but we'll get there. Oh, da, da, da. we'll hit him with a poison sting because that confusion is just super effective against poison types. So we'll go with Pidgeotto. Oh no, he disabled my favorite attack. So we'll 
hit him with gust. We'll put up a barrier with Marcel, and then we'll go with Confusion. You see the barrier really lowers that attack, uh, that physical attack. Um, so, really helps Marcel out. And since we already have that defense boost, we're just going to keep going with Confusion and knock Graveler out. So this is Silco. Um, don't believe we're ready to go in there right now. Spirit of the Pokemon. We're gonna heal up again. Just because we took some damage. Might as well, we're right here. Mr. Fiji is missing. Mr. Fiji is very important to us in this game. We need to find Mr. Fiji. But since we're here, we are going to actually purchase a couple items. Um, just because we have it. Why not? Let's grab five great balls. And does anyone know where you can find those items? The ones that can increase the stats? They are... Oh. Ooh, let's have them rate one of our nicknames. Fireboy. Wow. Rude as hell. But we're not going to change any of our names right now. Uh, what is South? South takes us uh, where exactly? Let's see. Hmm. We got another TM. I wonder what it is. What is TM thirty nine Swift? Actually thought Pokey was able to learn Swift, but we will teach it to Pidgeotto. Why not? Instead of Whirlwind. Whirlwind's anyway only useful when hunting in the wild, pushes away Pokemon, so Swift will be useful for us in battles. For right now at least. Our 
right now we're just really exploring. Um, there's no point in us actually going down this path. Because this goes to Lavender Town, and we're not be get, we're not going to Lavender uh, Lavender Town right now. We're going to be going to Celadon City. Um, so we're taking this lovely route over here. And Marcel grew to level 21. Hmm. And we defeated the gambler. Awesome, fun. You hurt yourself with, conf with confusion. Why? Why aren't you hurting yourself? You're confused. We're gonna see how Pokey does against the fairy. Try to poison the fairy. Fairy types. Does, uh, are poison to say is are they immune? Hmm. Can't remember if they're immune or not. She's trying to put us to sleep. Come on, Pokey, wake up! Wake up, Pokey! Wake up, Pokey! That double slap. We need to get better movesets for Pokey. We lost Body Slam because I was exhausted last time around. Which is not good. Not good. So. We need to see what other moves uh, Pokey can, can learn. Because otherwise we might have to uh, trade Pokey away. For the male version. Even though someone might not like it. Uh, alright. What do we have in this grassy area? I think we could catch a Growlithe. And a Vulpex here. But... Either way, we're, we need to beef up our team a little bit, get a couple levels for some of us, the weaker, uh, weaker Pokemon, so I'm just going to do a little bit of grinding. Because we got four trainers back to back to back coming up, so want to be able to grind right now. I don't think we ran into that guy. I don't remember where he is. I don't think we haven't run into him yet. But I don't remember where he is. So we got Marcel. Level 22. That's not bad for right now. But definitely want him to be level 25 before we're done. Oh, we've got a Vulpex. Not catching it. Come on, try and poison. Come on. Poison Stinger Red. Mm. 
another Pidgey. Remember when we caught a level 2 Pidgey on our first stream? Now we're fighting level 18 Pidgeys. Fun game. I love Pokemon. Absolutely love it. It's awesome. There is no game like Pokemon. There's the only other game that makes me feel as good as Pokemon does is going to be Final Fantasy X. I love that game, except trying to get the ultimate weapon. I hate those challenges. I hate those challenges. I hate those challenges. The lag is ridiculous, and I get so close that I just give up. I, I, I'm just I'm done with it. The lag just kills the game. Um, on the newer consoles. It's crazy. PS2, no lag whatsoever because the, the controllers were tied into the PlayStation. PS3 and PS4, we they can't figure out the technology to avoid the lag. I mean, come on. We're already on PS5. Are they going to create a remake for PS5 and we're still going to have lag? Making the timing to catch the ultimate weapons and dodging impossible? Hey, look at Meow. We could try and catch him out to give us a little bit more money. Should we catch him out? Try and get us some more money. Cerulean City? Huh. Maybe if we learn fly, we can fly Don't back. Have time to polish every email, report, or proposal. Oh, Jesus. Let Grammarly Christ. help you. Grammarly is a dip. Yeah, can't wait till we get sponsorship so I can see if someone is willing to, uh, to pay for me to have some Free tunes. Be nice. I don't want copyright issues. Spotify's being terrible. I might say about switching to Apple Music since I have Apple Music. Maybe Apple Music has a good playing playlist. And there we go. We defeated. All right, we'll throw Fire Boy in. Really, just trying to get some of our Pokemon up to level. Uh, um, so some of the upcoming battles are easier because um, we are getting into that stretch now. So trying to level up. And grind a little bit. Oh yes, please use, please me to use pay there. I need to be go easy on me so we can get more money. And we burned sand true. In Texas, that's called a flaming hog. Flaming hog. Get your flaming hogs here, flaming hog. Get your charbroiled hog here. Right next to the uh, 
It'd still, you know what? It'd still be KFC. Instead of Kentucky, it'd be the Canto. Canto fried chicken. Canto fried pidgeys. Because it, it, it shouldn't be pidgey. Because they could also fry some sparrow. So they'd serve pidgey and sparrow at KFC in Canto. Because it'd be Canto fried chicken. I'd eat me some at Canto fried chicken. Quality's probably better than KFC. And you'd know the Pokemon would be freshly caught. Freshly caught Sparrow or Pidgey, which would you order? I don't know why I'm trying to, trying to burn Vulpix. to the city and heal up there we go take my Pokemon let's heal Thanks for sharing. Thanks for sharing. Uh huh, sure, excuses, excuses. Tell him to get on and chat. Chat's actually recorded in the stream. You might not be able to see it. I might have to manipulate the size of the font a little bit. I can actually do that right now. But the chat is, is, appears where the haunter is. Thankfully for you, though, it it's just uh, chat size is going to be bigger. Just for you. Now we fight Super Nerd. building the Pokedex for the Kanto region um, and it's kind of impressive it's kind of crazy how they've came up with the weight the heights and the weights of each Pokemon and when you see the evolutions sometimes Pokemon they weigh 10 times more after their evolution and just think about that where all their bones and everything else inside their body just immediately multiplies by 10 in weight um, and it's just crazy it might not get that much bigger in size, but somehow they got 
a lot heavier. I think Grimer and Muck are almost the same weight. Even though Muck is slightly bigger. Um. Oh, perfect. One hit. Awesome, Marcel. Muck is slightly bigger. They're the same weight. It's kind of like the goo just stretched over. Alright, so we've got our four trainers. We can take them on a couple at a time. Small. And we're just going to play around here. Just let Pidgeotto get some experience. Marcel stay out. God, how many Pokemon does she have? Not a problem for Marcel. And you learned light screen, that's Awesome. We're just gonna keep Marcel so he could gain all the experience in the world. back finish the other two trainers off because why not Marcel hanging in there. Thank you, Marcel. Marcel leveled up. That's awesome. Another meow. We'll change our Pokemon. We'll let Meowth play around with Nidoran. Oh, I forgot. I need to change my team now that we have Nidoran. 
I will do that. Uh, we'll start off with that. Pokemon number is Duck Trio. Duck Trio is 51. So, him back. And there we go. That's our team. Go back to playing now. be more active this summer sierra helps you save on everything from swimsuits to stand-up paddle boards tennis rackets to fishing tackle and if that doesn't float your boat we also have pool floats sierra let's get moving to your local store like now go chipotle's all-new pollo asado starts with fresh grilled chicken and hand-cut cilantro finished with garlic guajillo peppers and fresh lime bright and flavorful try chipotle's new pollo asado only available for a limited time order now for pickup or delivery and another gambler, so we'll make some money. Get some money with, from the gambler. Polywag knows hypnosis. It's because of that stupid circle inside Polywag. So we'll switch that out with the visitor. So we have Clefable, perfect time because he's gonna use water gun and we're just gonna punch Polywag out. And knock him dead. He did. And our mega punch failed. Oh, don't fall asleep, visitor. Come on now. I need you to wake up.
There we go. We landed a hit and it's a crit. Awesome. Now we're up against Poliwhirl, we're going to keep Visitor, and we're going to throw another punch. You'll recognize that, oh, it keeps missing, I don't know, did they hit us with something that affected our accuracy? Notice that the swirls inside Poliwag and Poliwhirl reversed. Uh, I think Poliwag was counterclockwise and Poliwhirl is clockwise, it's actually kind of cute uh, when they do that. Right, and we're gonna go into this house. I don't know what the point of that is. I think there's a point to it. Super nerd. Burn Voltorb. Not gonna be uh, 2x because Voltorb in this game is just electric and not steel. If it was steel, Ember would have destroyed it. Yeah, we'll keep him out. Keep Fire Boy out, let him get some experience. And meltdown. Pretty appropriate. So we're going to this house, go in that little underground tunnel. never know if you're going to actually run into any items down here. There are hidden items down here. I don't know where they are. Um, but there are hidden items down there. So, we are now... Just bound to Lat Celadon City. A bunch of Team Rocket folks are. Heal our Pokemon and continue the adventure in Celadon City.
So we are, <coughs> excuse me, in the Game Freak headquarters right now, in Celadon City. <clears throat> and if we wanted to fill it up and get a shiny charm, we'd have to come back here, but we're not filling up the Pokedex. Because <coughs> we're not catching them all. part of Seldon City, the giant Mart kit. Where you can get everything. And you have the elevator. Which is a lot of fun. Alright, we're gonna go through each floor and grab some stuff. TM level. I don't know. The problem in this game is you can't you can't tell what the TMs are unless you open them after you buy it. Oh, we got another TM just by talking, folks. the trade floor. Did not remember that that existed here. Uh, okay, so if we want to evolve some Pokemon... Hmm. Yeah, why not? Oh, <laughs> we can't carry any more items. I hate that in this game. I absolutely hate how tiny your backpack is in this game. Oh, uh, so we're gonna go back down. We've got to go back to the Pokemon uh, or the Poke Center. Just so we can empty our bag and buy some stuff. Now we're just gonna do a giant unload of items and then we'll pick them up later. Pause it. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Uh, we'll throw the moonstone in there. TMs are going to go in there. HMs are going to go in there until we get uh, slow poke, and then we'll keep the HMs out. But for right now, we have both items in there, so no need. Put the leaf stone in there as well. Keep the max potion for the end game and the max ethers as well for the end game. All right, I think we can now go some do some shopping because we're gonna grab a couple of stones so we can figure out if we want to catch some Eevee and evolve Eevee, or if we want to utilize them on some of the other random Pokemon. So, um, Weeping Bell, for example, to go into Victory Bell, you need a Leaf Stone. Um, 
all the, the evolutions, obviously. Poliwhirl to Poliwrath, you, know, you need a Leaf Stone as well, so... We're just going to try and buy uh, at least one of each for right now, and then we can decide what we want to do with it later. Pikachu to Raichu, Thunderstone. So we've got one of each stone right now. Alright, now this is the area where you could buy um, items to increase the abilities of your Pokemon, or the characteristics. So HP up, exact, oh it means it's HP up. Protein is strength, I believe. Um, Carbos is speed. Uh, what was calcium? Um, calcium is defense. So, we're... It's a lot of money, we don't have that right now, so we're not going to go crazy on this. Uh, and I'm just going to walk away. I'm going to talk to the other guy here. These are the ones that you could use in battle, and it'll increase it in battle. Uh, I don't think it carries... I don't know if in this game it carries over to the following battle. Uh, I think it's a one-time use. So we're just going to ignore him too. Uh, and we're going to try and go to the roof. Oh. Protein is power, iron is defense. And then this guy said, what was calcium again? Uh, calcium is special ability. Yep, where are you want to go to the roof? She wants something to drink. Are these vending machines? There you are vending machines. So, if you don't know, buy lemonade. They are just, they were just about just as strong as high, um, super potions or hyper potions. And they cost less than half as much. So, we're going to buy a few. Only problem in this game is that it is very slow to buy because you have to select it and go to the, um, the actual, go down, and it's just slow. But, all right, we bought a fresh water. We'll give the guard a fresh water. How many did we grab? We got nine lemonades. We'll grab. Four more. Just so we have two for each one of our starting Pokemon and then two extra. And then one more. There we go. So, if you don't know, grab a lemonade. Uh, can you give this girl a lemonade? Yes, we can give her a drink. So, gave her a lemonade. And she gives us a TM. Try attack. Try get attack hits, um, was it water, electric, and fire? at once, so not a bad attack. Pretty useful. I have to decide who we give it to. Uh, I don't know who it's best to give to. We'll probably save that TM um, till we get to our final our final team. Why did I go back upstairs? I'm gonna go downstairs. But now at least we can um, We There's could give a, a drink to the guard. From the moment your plane touches down. It's Apparently Reagan Airport has a lot of money in advertisement. Alright, so we're going to go unload some of these items so that we're not over encumbered. I can't remember what game it was where you, if you're over encumbered you start losing HP every step you take. Oh, uh, it was annoying. Maybe it was Fallout. Was it, I think it was Fallout actually. So we're going to deposit a couple items, we're going to deposit all the stones.
So we'll con let's continue to explore Celadon City. See what we've got here. Hyperfang on Raticate is just crazy. It is extremely powerful and, um, yeah, extremely powerful. in against Zubat. It's gonna hit it with some scratches. Just a couple scratches. Hit it with a couple scratches. Um, I think one of these guys gives us a, one of these people give us a coin case. coin case so if we want in case we want to gamble and let's see can we go down here any of these people gonna give us anything they tell us a little bit about um well we got a coin case there we go Everyone's telling you that there's a secret door behind the poster. How much of a secret when the entire town knows about it? A people hotel. So let's heal up first and then we will go through and uh, go through Team Rocket's hideout. Since we are right there, um, might try our Lux at the slots, see if people give us some coins. Oh yeah, there we go, we got some coins. Awesome. Getting some coins. Oh. I'll talk to her. Well, you're having a wonderful time. Give me some coins. Oh, there we go. Got another 10 coins. Uh, 
and then the prizes are next door. We're gonna go next door, take a look at the prizes. Um, because I don't remember what they are. We can get an Abra for 120 coins, uh, Clefairy for 750, Nidorine for 1,200, a Pinsir, a Dratini, and a Porygon. And then some TMs for a lot of coins. I don't know, I've never, I don't remember playing the slots in, in Pokemon when I was a kid. I don't know if there is a strategy behind it. Um, da, 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 da. trying to see if there's any tips on the betting system I don't know if there are well might just try our luck right there and we'll bet three coins Ooh. Uh, we'll go one more time three coins Try a different machine. Coming a gambler. But not much luck. Alright, we'll try again. Terrible luck. We'll go to a different machine. We'll go to this row here. Gambling is addicting. Please call the gambling hotline if you're running into Pokemon gambling addiction. I don't know what the number is. I'll find out the number and I'll post it for folks to, uh, to hop on. I hate slots. If they had poker, I'd play. Might be able to win if they had poker. Hate slots. Hey, we got 15 coins. Still net lost 12 so far. But since this machine we went we won on, we'll keep at it. Nope, nothing lined up. It would be nice to win a Dratini. Um, it really would. I don't... I don't think I'm that lucky. I'm off. <laughs> this one was close. I don't think we'll get to thousands of points. I don't know any... I don't know anyone as a kid who went through and tried to win coins. I wonder if anyone actually did. Yeah, I wonder if anyone actually did. Alright, so we pushed the switch. It opens a door. Where does that door lead to? Where does that switch lead to? There's a secret switch. What does it do? Uh, 
It opens a layer for Team Rocket, but I don't remember where how to get to that layer. This right here is the gym. And we might as well just go through and beat the gym. This is going to be a big area for, uh, for Charmeleon. But after we beat the gym, we're going to have to figure out how to get to Team Rocket. And I can't remember where to find their lair. Oh, come on, don't fall asleep. Wake up. Oh. Oh my god, it's still going on. Had a five round bind. Or a wrap. This bell sprout is good. Another four rounds, five round wrap, and a four round wrap. That's not bad at all. All right, bye, bell sprout. Hope you grew to level twenty six. Weeping bell. Sure, we're changed just to get the. Balance out some of the experience. Throw Marcel over there. Uh, straightens confusion. Not gonna waste time. Come on. Really hate rap. But there's there a we feeling go. you get from the moment your plane touches down. These ads it's are killing the pure me. Relaxation These of ads your are killing me. Next time I'm going to log into Apple Music, since I pay for it. No, oh, no, Beauty was getting bored. Uh, no, we're gonna keep going with Pidgeotto against uh, against the world. Between Swift and Quick Attack, we should make quick work of this trainer. Nope. Ooh, not Poison Powder. Damn. Poison pow being poisoned and rap are just it's so bad because apparently each time you miss you can't make a move you still get hurt by the rap um so it's kind of like a double whammy so we'll switch out Pichioto from the starter uh, I think we're gonna fight the gym leader anyway we could fight two more 
craters. So why the hell not? We'll let we we'll switch Marcel in there. Just to get that extra experience. And I can't deny beauty her battle. Marcel with the one move regular attack. Just confusion. Hopefully it's a crit. Come on. Crit? Ah, uh, not a crit. Oh, come on now. Come on, Marcel. Come on, Marcel. Come on, Marcel. Can you not move because you're paralyzed, or can you not move because of the wrap? Which one is it? Alright, so Marcel is done. Bellsprout got lucky with that rap. And I think he did end up um, paralyzing Marcel. Surprised at that. By oh, there's a lot more trainers in here than I thought. Dig again, Spellbator. We still get hit with a leech seed. That's fine. Crit and super effective. Beautiful. And our duck tree levels up. In shock. Like, don't bring any of the Pokemon that we're, we're weak against in here, please. We want to beat you. Please don't bring the strong Pokemon in here. Dig, Diglet dig, Duck Trio dig, everybody dig. One hit KO, beautiful. So, in the Diglet tunnel, grind and catch yourself a Duck Trio level 31. Comes in extremely handy in a lot of battles. Don't underestimate, underestimate girl power. Why does she have a whip? Why does Cool Trainer need a whip? That's some freaky kinky shit. Cool Trainer running around with a whip. Is that how she got the name Cool? She just whips people? Actually hit with with rap. Not fun. Oh come on, come on. 
Let go of me, weeping bell. We go underground. Beautiful. And one hit KO. About to use gloom? No, we're not going to change out. We're just going to dig again. And one hit KO. Hey yo! Trinity for the win! Draw an Ivysaur, and we dig. Bye, Ivysaur. And we defeated Cool Trainer. We have one more trainer in here, might as well. Might as well knock her out. We're here. If you want to do a speed run? Don't have to knock her out. Ooh, we see execute. Psychic for psychic. So, Marcel does not have the HP for anything. No, oh, come on now, wake up. Wake up. Wake up. God damn it, wake up. That was a mistake on my part. I meant to use dig again. Button got stuck. We're just gonna mega punch the eggs. You would think punching an egg would break it and they would stop spitting seeds at me. Apparently, it's not working. They're still spitting seeds at me. And I'm saying spitting because they can't throw it, they have no arms. They have no arms, how are they throwing it? They're spitting it. It's the only way they could use that move. I'm getting spit on right now. It's great. And we defeated Beauty. Splendid! I'm just checking something here. So we we have Nidorina, not so I need to change my Pokedex here because that was the wrong number. And there we go. Um and when we get when we're done here, we'll probably just evolve her to a Nido Queen um with the Moonstone. But first, we will battle Erica. Dun dun dun! She starts without starts out with a victory bell. We're getting Marcel a little bit of uh, XP, but. Charmeleon is going to win this for us. Um, or I'm just going to keep giving him potions. Until he does. That ember should have killed him. Why did that ember not kill him? That ember should have killed him directly. Game is rigged. And exactly what I wanted. Marcel grew a level. She sends out Tangela. We're gonna burn that pile of wheat of vines. So wrap, it's constrict. Oh, one HP. Fine, she wants to use a potion, I'm going to use a potion too. 
we give Charmeleon a lemonade. And then we burn Tangela again. Oh, and Tangela's burn. I'm poisoned. Who's going to go first? Burn or poison? Not going to wait. Burn it again. If we burn Tangela and some of the other grass Pokemon, that would be the roasted vegetables that go alongside with KFC. So when you go to Kanto Fried Chicken, you get a side of roasted Tangela or some uh, roasted Bulbasaur's. Uh, it's really your preference at that point. I want to do the roasted vile plume. It's just the texture just doesn't. It's not very good. But some people like it. Stop! No, <laughs> had to be a critical hit. Oh, poor Charmander. Oh, poor Charmeleon, right at the end, too. So. Less than 5 HP. And Charmeleon, oh, I hate that. I hate when that happens. But. We got the Rainbow Batch. I'm going to unlock the Rainbow Batch on the stream right here. There we go. There's the rainbow badge. We got the rainbow badge. Poor Charmeleon. Feel bad. It's fine. We'll level him up as soon as we start facing Team Rocket. No, Pidgeotto fainted. This was Nuzlocke, we'd be in big trouble. If a, po a Pokemon is poisoned uh, and you're running around and it slowly kills your Pokemon and it's Nuzlocke, oh, that would be difficult. That would be a pain. At that point, you start using your items. All right, so... Yeah, I guess I guess we grab the uh, the moonstone and evolve get a Nido Queen. Should have done that earlier. I, I guess I just I kept thinking that Pokey was still didn't level up. I didn't completely forgot. So look at that, we have a Nido Queen. So, I will change our team layout again. And there we go, we've got a Nido Queen on our team. Alright, now how do we. Where is the Team Rocket hideout? Where is the Team Rocket hideout? We are actually going to go get a Nido Queen, a TM. What floor is that on? Um, 
what's a TM? Does one of, of y'all sell TMs? Yep, all right, we are going to buy TM7. So Horn Attack is a very strong move, however, it's, um, hmm. <laughs> it's, it's accuracy is very, very low. I think it's 30% accuracy. Um, but I'll take it since it's a very strong move and we can still use it. Or try to at least. All right, awesome. Um, we could also buy Mega Kick, but if we need to. We'll come back. I want to find out where Team Rocket is hiding. I can't remember where they. Um. Where's the Team Rocket hideout? Yeah, I thought the Team Rocket hideout was in that same area, but... Did we just not go down? There it is. So it's time for Team Rocket Battle. What we're gonna do is we're gonna save right here and take out Team Rocket. And so all that confused is why there's a little kid in their hideout. And it's just like, well, you told the entire town where y'all were hiding. Are you really surprised that there's a kid in your hideout now? So we're gonna go around, kick Team Rocket's ass, as always. First generation had the best enemy, I would say. Team Rocket was a legit enemy versus some of these other weird teams. Like Sword and Shield, I don't understand the bad guys. They were just cheering for someone else, so they didn't like you. That was stupid. I really hope they bring back Team Rocket. I, I don't think they will, but Team Rocket was like a legit bad guy team. Um, in all the games, yeah, you had one or two bad guys, but you didn't have like a bad team around them. I, I like Team Rocket. I like the concept of it. I hope they bring it back. But I highly doubt that's going to come back. Highly doubt. And there we go. With 30%. Missed already. Three times missing. 
But when it hits, it's a KO. <laughs> Took four chances to hit. Found an escape rope. Nothing down there. downstairs then now we're gonna enter that weird little maze area some little maze oh I like how the game tries to be fair with trainers that have more than three Pokemon. You can tell that their levels are weaker um, than trainers that have one or two Pokemon. It's just trying to balance out so that it's not too much of a hit on the trainer. Uh, but it's a nice little feature there. We got Poison again, Pidgeot, just constantly Poison. I don't know what it is, but yeah, sorry. Really want to keep growing Marcel, because um, he's going to be a big help. So we're going to go back and grab that. Item. If I can stop where I want to stop. There we go. Because Nugget! Oh, come on. There. Grab this item. Another Moonstone. Awesome. Found a super punch. Noise. Noise, noise, noise. Uh, is it up? That gets us out of here? No, that was the wrong one. Oh well, now we know our way. I think.
to be more active this summer? Sierra helps you save on everything from swimsuits to stand-up paddle boards, tennis rackets to fishing tackle. And if that doesn't float your boat, we also have pool floats. Sierra, let's get moving to your local store, like now. Go! And now we got it. Our Pidgeot died. That's sad. Our Pidgeot died. Poor Pidgeot. Getting poison is no joke in this game. We are going to continue to dominate with confusion and level Marcel all the way up. And then we're going to switch it around and use um, Charmeleon. Why not use Charmeleon? Burn that little rat. Burn that little rat. Intruder alert! They do nothing. Cell with his psychic ability is just he's just powerful in this game it's great and the reason they had to add dark type in future generations because they realized that psychic was overpowered um, and the one thing that was supposed to beat psychic was ghost but psychic also defeated ghost so it was kind of a it was an unfair advantage. Psychic is an unfair advantage. I wonder if you could have a full Psychic team, how powerful you would really be. You are still susceptible to um, bug-type moves. I don't know how many bug-type moves there are in Gen 1. Marcel with another one hit.
items they have in this one. Was it just that one item? I think it was just one item in this, this puzzle. another level Woo -hoo! sends out drowsy I try and burn drowsy drowsy is burnt keep burning drowsy use confusion that is and also we're going to swap out Fireboy and Marcel. We're down to another level in the basement. No more room for items. Let's see if any of these are Mega Drain. None of my Pokemon can learn Mega Drain. Alright, awesome. Horn Drill. The move I just bought. <laughs> Oh. Double edge. They can all learn double edge. So double edge is a strong move. Um, it's a normal move. However, you get recoil damage from it. It's a powerful one. Um, I didn't realize that Pidgeot uh, Pidgeotto could learn that. That was more of a on the ground Pokemon learning. Oh, da, 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 da. this one is interesting. Just to make room. Just to make room. We're going to get rid of Tackle. HP up. I'm going to take that HP up. And I'm actually going to give that... To, uh, the... I'm gonna actually give it to Marcel. Um, just purely because he is going to be our powerhouse. So. And we need to use items. Not leaving any items up for grab. Um, I want every item in this, in this run. Um, So, just trying to get as many as we can. So there's definitely some valuable ones. Uh, da, 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 da. What's TM2? Razor Wind. Yes, we will teach that to Pidgeotto. Which move should we forget? We are going to forget Gust and go for Razor Wind. Air move for an air move. So, not bad. Not bad at all. I think we got the lift key now, right? Oh. Good thing I went back. So you have to talk to him to get the lift key. I, for I, I forgot about that. I didn't realize you had to scare him. In order to get the lift key. So now we have the lift key. Uh, and we can make our way back. 
uh, to the second subfloor, I guess. Where we have to we go back through this silly maze. That I went the wrong direction in again. Wow, we've been streaming for almost two and a half hours now. Nice. All right, we might call it a night after we defeat um, Giovanni. Um, it shouldn't take us that long, actually. Wasn't this where we just were? Again, no more room. Remembers me from Mount Moon. Haha. 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 Gonna throw Charme uh, Charmeleon in there. Really wanted to get Charmeleon leveled up so we could evolve him to Charizard. It's gonna take us a little bit longer, but every little bit helps. Uh, probably next stream we'll get him to Charizard level. Oh, critical hit. No. Such a shame. Too bad, Charmeleon. The beauty of their evil. Team Rocket Rocket! I, I do love how creative Team Rocket was. With their songs and dancing and all that. It was just... It's very creative.
and we hit with one one hit KO with confusion. And Marcel stays in. He's about to send out Rhyhorn. Rhyhorn versus Marcel. Rhyhorn versus Marcel. Who is going to win? Rhyhorn versus Marcel. We have a battle ongoing. We are going to hit with another confusion. Rhyhorn is confused. It hurts itself with confusion. Is it going to knock Rhyhorn out? No, Rhyhorn is holding on. Rhyhorn's holding on, holding on, holding on. And he's dead. Rhyhorn's dead. Marcel level up. Wants to learn double slap. But Marcel can't learn double slap. We'll make room for double slap. No, we're not going to make room for double slap. No, no. Just give up. Yes. Not learn double slap. Alright. Kangas Kangaskhan. Marcel versus Kangas Kangaskhan. And Marcel hits with confusion. Marcel hits with confusion. Not as powerful. Maybe two hits. Oh. Oh, he ran out of PP for confusion. So, we are going to use the Almighty Visitor, the Rock of our team, and Mega Punch. Mega Punch versus Comet Punch. For now, Mega Punch wins. And we have defeated Giovanni. Oh my god. Wasted a hyper potion on this. Can't remember if you get a lap. There is a rest area. Um don't remember where that rest area is. Ah, uh, no, it's fine. I don't remember if you get a Lapras here or somewhere else. I can't, you get a Lapras, um, it might be in another city and I'm drawing a blank on that. Maybe after you get the soul badge, you find a Lapras. Yeah, I think it's after the soul badge. So, we defeated Team Rocket. They're all sad and defeated now. We're gonna go back upstairs. Say goodbye to all the degenerate gamblers. Sing in front of the Um, in front of the slot machines. We're going to deposit some items here. Since we have a bunch of um, lemonades, we're just going to deposit the super potions. Uh, we're going to deposit the coin case because I'm not using it right now. Uh, we'll sell off the nugget right away. We'll deposit the moonstone. Where's TM7? TM7, deposit that. We just bought it. Did not realize you were gonna, we were going to pick one up when I bought it. Nope, nope. We're going to deposit the rare candy, keep all the rare candies for the very end, and deposit the iron and the lift key. God, I really did not, I did not remember how limited you were on items in this game. It's terrible. Alright, we're going to go sell the nugget.
Sell the nugget, get us another five grand. Sweet Jesus, we got ourselves some money. can't remember what that woman is but I think that was important when you get when we get Lapras and we or surf and we're able to uh, swim around it would be beneficial for us to go visit her shares this with the other guards and now we're able to go to Saffron City but before we go to Saffron City we need to go back to Pokemon Tower um, and hence well, the reason why we're going to use this, still use this underground um, road. I don't know what else to call it. Road. We're going underground. We're going underground. We're going underground. 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 just to piss him off. Booyaka. War Turtle will change our Pokemon. Uh, we will defeat him with Pidgeotto and we'll use Razor Wind. We'll hit him with Sand Attack. 
Another sand attack. And we'll use Waste of Wind again. Oh, come on. That should have been a crit. Quick attack. Finish him off. There we go. And we defeated our rival. Red is no more. With that, we're going to save right in here in the Pokemon Tower. Uh, our Next week, we will finish out the Pokemon Tower and try to get um, another badge, catch another couple Pokemon, and um, go from there. Thank you very much for hanging out, watching. I will post some of the highlights uh, as I go through them, and see you all again next time. It's fun. I hope you like it. And keep on playing Pokemon. Have a good one.